feeling super lucky. So we're gonna go up these 2,000 steps. He takes YouTube so seriously. Why would he do that? Hoi. Yeah. Let's go. 3,000 more. Harry Potter. This side of the river is, well, the whole sea is very peaceful, but this side of the river is, I don't know, even more, like calmer, more of a residential zone, right, Hui? Yeah, I would say so. And the castle, the one we've just been to, amazing, um, but be careful, if you want to visit and take good photos and, I don't know, some good videos, you should come early in the morning, because now it was full of tourists, and it's half 11. Take that into consideration. Where are we headed now? Now we are heading towards the um, Buddha Castle, mm -hmm. and we will see if we can do the labyrinth underneath the Buddha Castle as well. All right. minutes now because we went all the way down uh, and then we had to come all the way up because every trip we make every country we visit we like to buy books in that country and Hui find out that the bookshop uh, that we want to visit was up here so we had to come all the way up we're gonna try to find the books now right no we are just going uh -huh. to find a bank so we can draw some money without paying a lot of fees oh, and right. then we need to come all the way up again to find the bookshop Great! Can't <laughs> wait then. Okay. We've got the money. We've got the money. We've got the money. And now we're going all the way up. Nothing can stop us. Right? <laughs> money. I'm not sure. It's closed. Thanks, Mike. It means we came all the way up for nothing, right? Yep. Nice. Roy, shall we go? He's still not giving up. He's gonna find a solution. So this restaurant was amazing, super small, like traditional food, right? Even though we ate pizza, but it's, it tasted like homemade pizza. We're headed to the labyrinth now because we went there and they told us that they no longer do the oil lamp guided tools. So we're going to do it, the normal one. Even though they say they do in their website. Yeah, be careful because I was about to repeat what you just said. <laughs> In their website, they say they still do them, but the guy told us that because of COVID, they stopped it. So, be mindful.
Well done. So, what's your review, sir? Hmm? What's your review? So, first of all, you can actually film and take photos. Uh, we thought we couldn't because there, there were some signs as we entered, but then apparently it's just near the cash um, desk. Um, it was quite nice, it's quite chill, chilly <laughs> down there. Chilled so, and chilly. So just make sure that you bring jacket. Um, it's actually very nice, you can do and it very dark. half an hour. Yeah. Um, for someone claustrophobic like me, it may not be in the right place, but anyway. It was a good experience. You'll make it through. I'm out of breath. I don't know why, but I think it's just the stairs to come out. But yeah, it was really good. amazing it was in hungarian because most of them was was were um, from here but we had um, audio guides in english it is well i'm god blowing I, yeah i'm gobsmacked <laughs> i love this word but it really raises awareness for i don't know what war makes to, to people and I, I have no words literally you really need to come um how much did we pay how much did we pay? I don't know, it was 10,000 in the currency. I believe it's like 15 euros each. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's really, really worth it. And especially being, being nurses, yeah. um, it kind of, you know, pays tribute to our professions as well and our colleagues that fight, that fought in the war. In the war, sorry. Um, it's really interesting, actually. So please come here and have a look. Yeah, the whole uh, tour takes around 60 minutes. You can get a real feel of everything and for example they show us the operating rooms and the instruments look just the same as ours do now happy kiddos highly recommend <laughs> highly recommend <laughs> It's a new day. We're still on the hunt for our books, our tradition. And remember the store we visited yesterday? It was closed. Today's open, but they only accept cash. So we had to come all the way down. We draw some money and now we're going all the way up. The store is very nice, very small, very traditional. And the gentleman is very kind. I was about to ask you what's our plan for today. You're gonna answer. That's a great question. No, right. actually, after this, we are going to the city mm -hmm. What's that? Which is like in the mountain. Yeah. And you have like a really nice view. Oh my God, I can talk out of breath. Catch your breath, mate. So you have a very nice view over the new river, the parliament and all the city actually. So looking forward to it. Alrighty. We found a lift. You okay, mate? Uh, doesn't look like it. If you have COPD, please don't come to Buddha. Stay in Pest, it's safer for you.
so the place we said we would visit, the Citadel, or however you say it, is closed. Temporarily closed. I think they're rebuilding some part of it. But we're hoping you can still see the statues and the overview of the city from up there. So guess what we're doing? Climbing more stairs. Okay. Someone's tired. I am. I think I already saw enough. She was like, yeah, I think we've seen enough. We can go now. And we're barely halfway there. Come on, mate. There's only five kilometers to go. No, now for real. Is it too far from here? Mm -hmm. Is it too far from here? There's a bench. I'll wait for you. Come on. Stop it. But it's amazing to come across so many different people from so many different countries and you know my motto we're all made of the same it really makes sense to me because we hear we come across people speaking different languages they look different from us but in the end of the day we're literally all made of the same so boundaries and territories and I don't know, different countries different you know what i mean what for? Not the most appropriate time for me to be this poetic. Poetic? While we're going uphill. I'm not tired, I'm just emotional. You alright? But it started raining, so now we're trying to flee. Now we're crossing a bridge. And obviously, I'm afraid of working bridges. Why? Especially the ones that you can see cracks on the floor. <laughs> like this one. You're safe, mate. Last day, we're worried about many things because there's a storm going on in the UK and they've uh, put out the red alert, right? Yeah. So we don't know if we'll be able to fly or not. We've left um, our luggage in a luggage locker, but it's like on the street. We don't know if it's safe. So yeah, that's it for what's worrying us right now. Now we're in Margaret Island. Margaret Island, yeah. And this is amazing. It's like a high park in and out. Super nice. Last minutes in Budapest spent eating chimney cake that we love so much. And we're now headed to the airport. We're gonna catch our flights, hopefully. And yeah, that's it. Hope you've enjoyed the vlog. Thanks for watching. Please make sure you subscribe, press the like button, and share it with your friends. Thank you for all the support. You know the truth. Thank you. See you soon. Say bye.